To recover our Windows, we need to create a bootable USB drive. Get a USB drive that's larger than 8 GB and remove all the data from it because everything will be wiped when we install the bootable drive. Go to the link in the description, microsoft.com, software, download, Windows 10. And here you can see, download this tool. Click on that. Media creation tool. Run the installer. Agree to the terms. Select create installation media, USB flash drive, DVD or ISO. Because we're doing this for another PC, we need to change the language for the said PC and also the architecture. So we're going to take English United States Edition Windows 10 and it's a 64-bit system. If you're unsure, you can select both. And here we can select USB flash drive. And here I have my flash drive. And uh, make sure it's the correct flash drive and that you have backed up the files on it if you want to save any file on that drive. And now you just wait for the progress to complete. The USB boot drive is now ready. You can click finish. All right, now we can remove it and put it into the computer we want to fix. Right, insert USB and start the computer. Now we need to go into boot menu. So click boot menu or get into BIOS. Select the disk in the boot menu which resembles the USB drive you put in there. In this case, the SanDisk SanDisk Cruiser 8.02. Just click that. We now arrived at Windows Setup. And here you can see time and currency format and language and stuff like that. Um, we can change our keyboard to Swedish because I got that one, so if you have a non-English keyboard you need to change that. So we successfully created the boot media and successfully booted the Windows from the USB. You can now continue and install Windows or repair Windows using the tools provided. Well, I hope this video helped you, and if it did, please leave a like. Comment below and subscribe. I'll see you next time. This is your host, Jim Odesson, signing out.